so it's the next day, it's the next morning, it's like kind of like 9.30 I think. A little early, um, especially since we went to bed at like 2 last night. Um, but yeah, like I promised, we're at Hollywood Studios uh, here to get a lightsaber. Uh, it is really bright, so if we're squinting, yeah. it's because neither of us brought a hat or a sunglass. But yeah, we're gonna head back on the Galaxy's Edge uh, on planet and see if they have the saber I'm looking for. Come join us. All right, guys. So I just got we just got out of um, Doc Ondor's, where I did get this uh, adventurous uh, saber set. I, this vlog might be actually kind of short because um, they don't s usually. I think they c allow you to send merchandise to the front of this park, and so the plan was to get it and send it to the front and be able to kind of like do some things while uh, we wait for it. And usually it takes like three hours for it to get to the front. Um, but for the, the Saj Venture Sense, they're not doing it. Um, I don't know if that's just a rule for all the Legacy Sabers. This was my first time asking if they would be able to do it and they pretty much said no. Um, but yeah, so this is, this is what I'm looking at. So it does have a handle on it, but I don't feel like carrying it around. And I'm not really sure what rides I'd be able to take that on anyways. And if I'm going back to the car, I'm not coming back out. It's too, it's too hot today. Um, but yeah, let's take a look at the box. And as you can see, like the box is pretty big. And this is number 436 of 1350. So they only made um, 1,350 of these and I got the 436th um, set. This actually costs 400 plus um, tax, so it ended up being like $426 um, for the whole set. But I'm gonna, when I take it home, I'll unbox it, like you'll see it's, I think it's worth it, just, but I collect sabers, but it's a box set, so it's, it's like two sabers in a box, and it's a Saj Ventress's saber, and, you know, Saj hasn't been out for a while, so I don't know if they're gonna bring them out again. They only did this because of, um, the Bad Batch, uh, uh premiere, and, uh, Saj's, uh, like, appearance in it, so that's why they released the Saj Ventress sabers. Um, but yeah, so, like, I don't feel like carrying it. The handle is strong, but it it's kind of heavy, so I'm not, I don't I don't feel like carrying it around. Um, but yeah, so the plan gonna shift, and if I if we don't if we're not back, um, thanks for watching the vlog and this short little bit at Hollywood Studios. Well, I lied. Um, actually, we're not closing yet. I forgot we probably should do an unboxing of the what uh, the thing I got. Um, so we're back home. It was kind of hot, so we left pretty early. Got something to eat, came home and knocked out because we had a long night yesterday and then we went straight to Hollywood Studios today. Um, and today was hot, so we came home, took a nap, um, freshened up. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna unbox this thing. Um, so like I said, this is the Saj Ventress um, box set. I haven't really looked at the stuff online. I just know I wanted these Saj Ventress um, lightsabers. Um, but I started collecting them after they had discontinued them for a while. So I haven't had really a chance to get um, the Saj Ventress um, sabers yet. Um, but so that's, if I got my opportunity, this, uh, I don't know if you see the number on here. 436. Oh, 436 of 1350. And so I'm gonna unbox it and kind of show you how it looks. I'm gonna, I'm not sure if I'm gonna do this like Live. I've never done an unboxing, so excuse the um, crudeness of the video. First time doing this, but I thought it'd be kind of cool to show you guys uh, kind of what I collect. Um, and like I said, this is just was um, 426 after tax. So let's get into it. Oh, oh, hey, Marie. She came to say hi. She wants to know. She's she just excited too. Like, what is this? Watch the knife, Curly. Oh, oh that's not a good. Hey, hey, hey. All right, I think she's good. She she got her she got her sniffs in, and she's she's good. Um, and then the handle. It actually lasted pretty well. Um, you can see it kind of crinkled. This is something you don't want to be carrying all day. Um, my hands are starting to get red. Like it's not heavy. It's just like the material, and when it's hot outside, it kind of 
uh, makes your palms sweat and that rubs up against your hands and you can rash up and whatnot. Um, so let's see what we got in here. Oh wow. Okay. So you get some foam for protection. So let me kind of show you what's inside. So you can kind of see what's inside. I'm gonna take this out. Um, and then I'll show you like what it actually looks like, but it's got some like film on it, shrink wrap, but I'm gonna take it out. I'll be right back. All right, so I got it out of the box. Um, so you can kind of see, uh, she, got, she got a little present too over here. She's, um, she's, that's her toy. So she's gonna play in that for a little bit. So this is what it kind of looks like. Um, you see it's got like hinges on it. It's kind of turned around, it's got a little clasp on it. Um, let's turn it around. So this side also has hinges on it. So, hmm, hinges on both sides, a little clasp in the center. I'm curious what the color of the saber is because um, I know Asajj has a couple of um, variations on their lightsabers. That I think she had red because she was originally a Sith and then it changed to um, white. And I think now she's yellow in the Bad Batch, but I'm not sure. Um, but we'll see what color the lightsabers are. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna put it up together, um, but yeah, let's open it. And then you can kind of see uh, what the, they look like. All right, so I just unboxed it. It's kind of, it's pretty cool. I, I, I love the design on it. Um, it's solid, like solid wood. So I haven't opened it yet. So I don't know what I'm looking at when I get inside. So I, I wanted to do this with uh, all y'all. So, right, so here we go. Ta-da! Oh, that's cool. Okay. So it comes with a card that it's, I guess this is, it's weird. It says 427. So maybe it's 427 of 4,500. So maybe this unit is the 427th built, but the number on the box is probably what the number of the box for the, the um, crate it was in. Let's look inside. Oh, that's cool. I'm not sure what I should take out and what not to take out. Oh yeah, check that out. Okay, that's pretty cool. So, you, so that's one of them. I want to make sure I remember how to put this back in. I guess we don't need the foam. All right, let's see. That's so cool. So, so Saj has two, like right. They're hefty. They're pretty hefty. Oh, it's so cool. Oh, I already forgot how, how it goes in. So that's what you get. You get the two sabers in the box. And I think underneath, like I said, I don't want to ruin the box. All right, so um, there. So I popped this off. It's like two layers of foam. And in here was actually, um, this is the connector piece to connect the two sabers together. So you're supposed to be able to make like a little sidewinder kind of thing. I might try to put this together and show you what it looks like fully assembled. Um, and then the Allen wrench that goes with the screws in there. But yeah, so this, let's put this back. All right, I'll be back. I'm gonna um, put this together and kind of see what what's what with this. All right, so I did get these out, um, the sabers. So I got the two sabers here. All right, yoink, yoink, two sabers. Um, the connect, the Allen wrench, and the connector. So I'm gonna try to see how to put these together. I don't know if I will, cause I kind of wanna keep it in good condition and I don't really want to mess with some of the screws, but I might, I might. 
because I want to see the whole thing built together. But um, so the bottom of the box, right? So this is the bottom of the box. Um, this is where they have all your instructions and everything. I don't know why they put it on the bottom of the box. Like I feel I feel weird putting it on its side like this. Uh, I wish they would have just put like an instruction card in there or something, or even like as part of like some of this, like just on the back, maybe even like a QR code or something. Um, just so that you don't have to like, you know, go to the bottom of the box. Um, but so here's the example, uh, some of the language on it. It's um, Disciple of the Sith, Asa Adventurous, Legacy Lightsaber Set. Um, and it's got a few different languages. Um, so one thing about the Legacy Sabers is most of them require AAA batteries and three. So each one's gonna have one, three AAA batteries. So you need a total of six. And I don't think that's included. I'll let you know if it is, um, but I don't think they're included. Actually, they might be included. I'll let you know. Um, some of the newer lightsaber legacy sabers do have the ability to charge via USB. Um, but since these are like older generation sabers, they don't have that. But what I don't see on here, and I wish they had it, is sorry i'm just making sure i didn't miss it um they don't have instructions on how to connect it so i don't know i'll see if i can find something on how to connect it okay so i think it's kind of self-explanatory how to connect these um so they got these uh bolts here right there's one right here and it seems like i gotta take these off pop the bottoms off and then this will probably couple it where this will probably attach to one bottom and this will attach to the other bottom and then replace the bolt. I'm gonna try that. I'll be right back. There's another bolt on the other side. The other cool thing is these come with belt clips right here. So you can get, um, I forgot what they're called, but this will actually be able to clip onto your belt. So like you'd be able to, kind of hang it down like this and this would just catch on it. Um, it's a kind of um, belt harness, I guess you would call it. All right, this one's a little snug. Okay, that one came out. And so if you're ever curious, this is where all your speakers are. So just be careful, speakers are down here. Right, so let's put this one in. Need to go too tight on it because I mean, unless you're gonna be wheel like I'm not gonna go too tight, I just want it just kind of in there. Yeah. check if there's batteries in here well let's check if there's batteries in here I'll check one maybe I don't need to take both out
All right, so the battery pack. This is what the battery pack looks like. You actually need, I don't know if it's focusing on it. There's a little screw here, so I gotta get a screwdriver for this. I'll be right back. All right, I got a screwdriver. I'm gonna try to take this off. I guess. All right, so it does come with batteries. All right, that's cool. Um, one thing I will say, and what I'm gonna do with these sabers when I'm done um, testing it and everything, um, it's highly recommended to actually not leave the batteries in the pack, because what happens is um, these batteries, if you don't um, regularly maintain it or turn it on, um, what's gonna happen is these batteries corrode and then um, once it corrodes in the battery pack, um, it'll actually break the battery pack itself so, and then you can't use it anymore. Um, so like when I'm done, I'm gonna actually um, take these batteries out. I'm not gonna leave them in, but there's the battery pack. So I'm gonna put it back in. Pretty easy, um, pretty easily accessible as you saw. And you don't need to tighten too tight. And so when you put it back in, back into the saber, I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but you can kind of see there's like a little notch here. And so it's gonna line up in the saber down in there. There's gonna be like a little notch that's kind of in the same shape, like the triangle. And as long as you line it up, it should just go in. Okay. I should. There we go. Back in. All right, let's keep going with the show and putting this back together, putting this together. I'm glad they had the batteries because I don't want to take the other one out. And just like that, we got Asajj's lightsaber put together like that. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Very unique, it's like, like I said, a little serpentine. All right, so I got it put together. It wasn't too bad. Like I said, there's two bolts here and you just kinda gotta take them out, take the little bottoms out and then replace them. Um, they do come with batteries. So the last bit, um, before we turn it on, is we actually got to put the blade in. And so they actually come with these um, blade plugs. Um, and you'll see in the blade plugs, when we go to put it back, there's little notches. And these notches will line up with notches in the actual hole here. But for now, we can just kind of put that out. Put that out. And let's um, put a blade in. All right, so the blades still only go in one way. So you just gotta like, see these. Nope, that's. All right, the notches. So yeah, they got notches here. So you line up and you push and twist. And let's do the other side. twist. Alright, so let me get up for this. You can kind of see it's a pretty tall lightsaber. 
I'm not gonna like swing it around. And to activate it, there's a switch right here, this little red switch, and you switch it on, and there you go. And I guess the sides is red, so they did keep her original color. So I don't know if this is gonna come in the whole shot, but let's 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 go. That, that's pretty cool, right? It's heavy. It's a it's really heavy. I don't know how Asajj would actually fight with this, but I guess there you have it. That's the Asajj Ventress uh, lightsaber box set. Pretty cool, right? Um, so yeah, I'm gonna take this back, put it back to where it was. Uh, like I said, I will take out the um, battery pack. Um, just because I don't want the batteries to corrode in there. Um, huh, look, she's a. Uh, and if you don't like it, it can suck in as a cat toy. <laughs> but I hope you liked the video. I hope you liked the unboxing. Like I said, this is my, uh, one of my first unboxings of lightsaber, and this was kind of it's a pretty decent lightsaber. Um, the box is wood, so like these box sets. They're really good quality boxes. Like it's de it's a decorate it's for decoration. You really, I took it out just to make sure everything worked and everything. But really, it's for display, um, and it's just for decoration. All right, like you could I guess play with it, but um, but yeah, I'll stop rambling. I hope you liked the video. I hope you liked our series here. Um, I'm not sure if we're gonna connect it with our Epcot series or we're gonna make this its own um, vlog. And I uh, hope you liked it. I hope you enjoyed our, our um, video. Hopefully it's not too short. But yeah, uh, remember to like, subscribe, uh, favorite. Um, and we have some Instagrams. So we got some TikToks. So follow us on those. Uh, we'll put those in the description. And Marie is telling me to stop. So we're going to close it out here. See you on the next vibe.